In this step-by-step -step tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can use Easy Ads on Shopify. This is going to be a quick and easy tutorial. I'm also going to show you guys the advantage of using Easy Ads on this video. So first thing you need to do guys, you want to log into your Shopify store. And it's going to take you guys to your Shopify dashboard as you can see here. Now next thing you need to do guys, you want to click on settings at the very bottom left. And you want to click on apps and sales channels and you want to click on Shopify App Store in the top right, okay? So you wanna click on Shopify App Store here. It's going to take you guys to your Shopify App Store. Now what you guys need to do next, you wanna search for Easy Ads. Okay, so you wanna click on EI Easy Ads for Facebook Ads, which is the app we want to download. Okay, so this is like the official app of Easy Ads, as you can see. Now what you guys need to do is you wanna click on Install. Okay, so as you can see, Easy Ads is an EI powerful like powered uh, advertising app that helps you launch an effective advertising funnel on Facebook on Instagram in minutes to promote your product catalog profitably and grow sales as you can see now what you guys need to do you want to click on install and it's going to take you guys directly to the app okay so in the next page you just need to click you just need to click on install okay confirm click again on install it's going to take you guys to this page. So what you guys need to do here, as you can see, you can also watch this video on how easy ads work, but I'm going to show you guys exactly how you can do this, how you can like use easy ads. Okay, so here you want to click on start free trial. Okay, so next thing you need to do guys, you, as you can see, it's like things to know how much I will be charged. You will not be charged during your free trial. So they give like 10 days free trial, you can use like easy ads for free and if you don't like easy ads you can always go to settings apps and sales channels and delete the app and you will not be charged you just need to do this before 10 days in so as you can see your free trial is for 10 days as you can see how do i cancel simply remove easy ads from your store settings i'm going to show you how you can do that if you don't like if you don't like the app okay if you don't like to use easy ads now i'm going to click on start my free trial Okay, next thing you need to do guys, you want to click on approve here. And by the way, the the like this is the amount you are going to pay each month after like 10 days free trial, you will have to pay almost like $30, okay? So I'm going to click on approve. Okay, next thing you need to do guys, as you can see, you will have to connect your Facebook profile. Like I already did that, that's why I am not like they are not asking me guys to connect my Facebook profile. Now probably for you, you will see here like Facebook profile and you will have to connect it, okay? You will have to click on connect and click on connect to Facebook. And after that, you will you will have again like to connect your Facebook page if it's not connected automatically. Now you wanna click on, on here as you can see and you wanna select which Facebook page you want to connect to Easy Ads, okay? Because you will have to create a Facebook page in order to use easy ads of course that's uh, for sure okay so you want to click here and select which piece if you have like multiple pages on facebook and here fa like business manager you you also have like to have like as you can see uh like you always you, you need to choose like a business manager with access to your ad account and here like facebook ads you want to add here like uh, your facebook ad account as you can see have added one now you co you also have like to choose Facebook Pixel that is installed on your store. Uh, if you if like if you don't have Facebook Pixel, they will ask you guys to connect it here. You can always watch a tutorial about how you can do it. Okay, so they will ask you guys to create a Facebook Pixel just in case you don't know this. Okay, after that you want to click on create. Okay, in the next page, guys, as you can see, select products to promote. You want to click on select products to promote here. And you can add here the categories. For example, on my Shopify store, I sell things that are, that has, that, that ha like, uh, that are, um, like something like uh, Halt and Beauty. That's exactly the products I sell on my Shopify store. And also you can add like multiple, like category here. Now, the only category now I sell on my Shopify store is Halt and Beauty. Click on save. And next thing you need to do guys is, as you can see, you can choose like funnel, as you can see, funnel setup, uh, like set up your advertising funnel by adjusting the ad content for each funnel stage below. Okay. 
so you can also edit the product styling how you want your ads to look like you can also change this for example if you want to change this and as you can see the ai makes images for you you can just choose which image you want which is like the beauty of using this uh like uh, easy ads app as you can see it allows you to create multiple images as you can see here now after you are done click on you can also click on info tag and you can change the style as you can see i'm going to click on publish changes and after that you want to click here and you want to choose one of these awareness or consideration or decision loyalty now each like funnel has different target as you can see uh, awareness for example these ads will target will target new audiences like as you can see this is how it's going to look like on facebook as you can see and this is how it's going to look like on instagram as you can see great quality with big discounts this is like awareness like it will target like new audiences but if you click on consideration as you can see consideration uh it will like target websites website visitors who didn't purchase okay uh that's exactly the target audience and if you click on decision as you can see this is how it's going to look like on facebook get 50 percent of your first order you can also change this of course add text you can always change this you can or you can also like generate add text with the ai they have like added this new technology to their uh website which is like you can also change here you can also like uh, choose the your language and you can also like uh, describe your products here you can also add uh, a special offer if you want and like the ai will generate a text for you so yeah that's exactly how it works like you can also like like so you can you can also like add multiple products as you can see or one product and the loyalty as you can see these these ads will target uh like will retarget customers like if like you if these customers already purchased an item for you uh from you they will uh, like uh see that ad again okay you will see like you liked it bought it got it loved it why not buy it again or get it again as you can see so that's exactly the loyalty uh that's exactly what this does and also i'm going to choose here on consideration and you want to scroll down and click on launch okay so after guys you click on launch uh you want to then uh like add like you you want to then like like uh like add here the target audience which is like i'm going to target people from age uh 18 to age uh, for this product to age like uh 40 okay so that's what i'm going to do right now also the gender i would like to target only like male or you can target like all genders um after that here the location you want to select the location you want to target so i would like to target the which i would like to target for example let's say i would like to target australia you can also target like multiple locations for example I'm going to target Australia and let's say for example I'm going to target um Argentina or like uh United Arab as you can see or Afghanistan you can like choose multiple locations here and here you can also target languages I'm also go I'm going to target like English and French I'm going to target like French and English. This is the interest. You will have to enter here the interest, the, so that like Facebook will show this to the to the in, like people that are interested in your product. For example, I like to like target people who are interested in uh, watches. For example, that's what I'm going to do here. So I'm going to add here watches. watches and you can also like add multiple interests here for example smart watch this just depends on your product now here you can scroll down and here the daily budget which is i'm going to set it to uh like 20 dollars okay 
so you can also change the currency if you want here I'm going to change it to sixteen dollars like the amount uh like w like ma like of course easy ads is not going to uh to, like use the money like this is going to be this is going to be uh this is going to go directly to meta okay so this is going to go directly to facebook as you can see it also says here i understand that easy ads does not charge me for any for my ads and that i pay my ad directly to meta okay so here you can also let the ai uh optimize your daily budget for you like that's exactly a very good call feature you can just enable this and it will like uh add uh, you can op like it will like uh, optimize your daily budget for you automatically for example or oh, like the maximum daily budget is going to be twenty dollars and here you want to check this box where it says i understand that easy ads does not charge me for my ads after that you want to click on launch my ads okay so this is like easy ads is creating your funnel this is going to take a few uh seconds or minutes like sometimes it takes a few minutes so i will come back after this finishes so as you can see guys your advertising funnel was successfully created as you can see you want to click on go to dashboard and here you will see your ad spend and impression impressions clicks and revenue and you can also see you can also disable here if you don't if you want to disable for example decision like ads in this funnel stage target like people who like almost like purchased your product before you can just uh disable it if you want um i'm going to disable it as you can see it says a processing you can also disable like ads in uh, loyalty like which is like ads in this funnel stage target to customers who previously purchased from your store okay so you can also change here the daily budget if you want to change it here as you can see the company is active here and if you click on settings you can change like the daily budget you can change the audience targeting you can choose the advertising funnel meta account you can also select products to promote in your easy ads campaign you can also like customize the products as you can see improve how your product looks on ads image customization if you can like use it you can change like the images stuff like that okay so yeah that's exactly guys how you can do this you can also add like products categories like if you if some of your products don't have categories you can add the product categories here could also create a new funnel here as you can see in the top so that's exactly how this works if you have any questions let me know in the comments i reply to every single comment if there is anything you don't understand here ask me in the comments and drop a like and see you guys in the next video